This is it, it's a Skylark. It is rough, super rough. Been broken into as well. Back of it's rough, the roof is rough, the door is rough, the window is busted. I don't know if the jacks work. There's no appliances. Looks like somebody got drunk in here and just busted a window on. This is absolutely... The roof might have to be taken apart. All this cabinetry probably is going to get ripped out. Window's gone. Handyman special. Old foam on the bed area. Okay, we got it home without an issue, and let's have a look at it. Broken glass. There, maybe you can hear me now. I guess I get an extension cord out of the mix. Well, it looks like they rigged some kind of cupboards, some kind of jar system for appliances would have been they just I don't know what that is put some stuff there it actually has a hose which I'm probably guessing if you hook the outside hose to this one and turn it on and you have a valve here you'd actually have running water it's if you're on if you're on seawater there's another cord that I'm not sure is what it's from some kind of dresser I don't know what's going on this is movable. I think what I'm going to do is everything that's movable first is going to come out. And once that's done, we can start having a look at the ceiling and is the ceiling in good shape? And then start taking things down just with a screwdriver. That's going to go in garbage. I don't know. We've got a bunch of different themes going on here. Some terrible curtains. It's a junker trailer. It's absolutely horrible. This is where the wheel wells go. It's like it wasn't big enough maybe for somebody to sleep. So they put a piano hinge on here. I, I don't know how it was supported from the underside. That's a bit unclear to me. Well, it looks like there was a table connected to this piano hinge, which has been ripped off. Which must maybe be this thing over right here. Oh, there's some kind of sander. So you know what, I think I'm just 
Knowing all this, I'm going to get rid of that foam. I'm going to get rid of everything into the garbage. Oh, this is an interesting find. Is uh, It's a log. It's a log tool for grabbing full logs. Very old. That's a neat find. Okay. This is actually for making ropes, but I use it for doing the jacks. So the windows look actually pretty good, a couple of them, but I'm going to put a mask on and I'm going to start gutting this thing. I think that's the only way. So I think the best way to do it, I'm going to pull my truck over here, put the back just out the door, with the garbage bin in it that is going to go to the dump as is, and just start undoing things and pitching things in here. Okay, we're getting the better of this thing, but it's still pretty solid. So we ripped off this stuff. It's really gooey. I don't know what it is. There's some kind of resin on there, but this thing is just built like a brick shit house, as my father would say. More screw points and all this sort of stuff. So this is the last piece of that I'm trying to break besides that piece on the ceiling, which I don't know what I'm gonna do with, but Metal flashing has got yet a fourth one of those type of bits. So I'm going to have to change my bit again if I've got that bit somewhere to do that. And then we're going to start working on some more of this side and that bloody cage I can't get off of there. And this thing. Yeah, still lots to do. Let's get this out of here. Look, there's actually a window there at some point that was filled in. Why? I don't know. A window was in a pretty good spot right there. There is carpet up there. So I gotta take this rail off, roll up that carpet, and get the heart right here. Here's where we're at. You take a sort of final look. All that cabinetry's gone. The roof is a little worse for wear. I don't know. I'm gonna have to check on the outside. The steam that went to the outside was a drainage basin or a urinal. I don't know what that thing was, but it's gone. I actually did a quick sweep. I see there's a couple things there I need to get out. But not bad, she's right down to the guts, the windows are open, 
So she's breathing a bit. The floor, I like the color of the floor, but the floor is gross and it's got to go too. So now that I got all the wall stuck, right kind of down to the to the studs and the insulation, now it's kind of some more interesting stuff like the floor. Yeah, that little retaining piece against the floor is going to come off. And then I'm going to start ripping this floor. I did think this was a little interesting. Yeah, sort of a fish eye view with just my tools up front there. But this uh, floor that I was like, should I take it off? It's actually floating. So it's going to... Original vinyl. Isn't that something? Yeah, that's gonna come up too. Let's do that. So here it is. My truck filled with shit. My garbage is filled with shit. Got everything kind of cleaned off, taken apart. It's fairly clean on the sides. Not too bad. It's got some holes and stuff. Windows not bad. Lights are of no consequence really. This is just for vanity, that's garbage. That's garbage, I might pop those things out tomorrow. This is just a vanity garbage piece where there was something. So then the window's broken of course. And then inside, you've got the regular old floor that really nice window that slides open and that bench same window on the opposite side pretty much where the refrigerator used to be and that's a whole nice bench it's all insulated this is where the window was so that goes to the cab of the truck nice big window there and the old original windows on the sides there other than that Stuff on the ceiling's probably coming off tomorrow, but I think for one day that's enough. <laughs>